Okay, what I want to do now is look into uh, subtraction. And subtraction is pretty much the opposite of addition. Where addition is combining things together, subtraction is taking away things. So let's look at a simple subtraction problem. And let's look at this visually again. We have 5, and we want to take away three lines, so one, two, three, and what we're left with is one, two. So that answers our simple subtraction problem. Now let's take a look at a more complex problem. For example, 253 minus 44. Now again, the structure of this is that we have like terms placed on top of each other. We have the ones, the tens, and the hundreds all lined up. And if we were to have larger numbers, we'd continue on to the left. So we'll start on the right, and we'll look at these two numbers. We have 3 minus 4. Now we have a problem here. We cannot subtract 3 minus 4 so we're going to use a special method here we're going to look at the number next to the 3 and we have a 5 so what we're going to do is take 1 away from 5 and it then becomes a 4 now another way of looking at this is the 5 is actually a 50 and when we take one away, it becomes a 40. So what we actually did is take a 10 away. And where that 10 ends up going is being combined with the 3. So the 3 becomes a 13. And what we can now do is look at the ones again and see that we have 13 minus 4 which is equal to 9 so then we can actually move forward and we can see here that we have 4 minus 4 which is 0 and we're left with a 2 in the hundreds place so we'll just bring it down and so our answer is 209 now, since this is a subtraction problem, we can actually check our answer with addition. And the way we would do that is take our answer, 209, and add it to the bottom number. We'll have 44. And when we add it, we'll go ahead and add it here. 9 plus 4 is 13. Uh, 4 plus 1 equals 5 and we'll have a 2 and we bring it down and as we can see our numbers match up so let's remember that uh, addition and subtraction are opposites of each other and that they are very fundamental concepts in mathematics